Hi, I'm James Ward, a technical evangelist for Flex at Adobe. I wanted to show you one of the new features of Flex 4.5. This is the new Spark form control. So a form is a fundamental part of a lot of applications. And now we have the ability to uh, use the new Spark form control to do data entry and organize how our data entry fields uh, are displayed on the screen. And then easily skin those to be displayed uh, in a number of different ways. So let me show you those. So here we have a simple form control in Flex. So you'll see that it's the S colon form tag now because we're using the Spark architecture for this form. And then we can specify our items in the form. So there's a form item. Uh, the first one is a text input. Uh, and then we have a couple check boxes uh, and then a button. So this is a very simple form. There's a lot of other data entry controls that you can use, uh, but this will get you started being able to build data entry controls in Flex. So let me run this one so you can see what it looks like. So as you'd expect, this is just a standard form, data entry, check boxes, and buttons. Uh, but it's organized this, it's lined everything up really nicely, and now we can really go in and customize this through custom skins. So let me show you that. So there's an out-of-the-box skin for the form called the Stacked Form Skin. And this will allow us uh, to organize our, our form uh, in a vertical manner rather than kind of a two-column manner. So let me show you this one. When we run this one, you'll see that everything is organized a little bit differently here from the original one. So we get the labels for the form fields above the data entry controls. And this is really more useful in a, a mobile paradigm on a mobile application. Uh, this is more typical of how you'd organize the form. And we can also do some cool things like sequence numbers. So you see there's a new uh, property here on form item called sequence label. And let me run this one. You can see what this one looks like. So with the sequence label, uh, I'm putting a sequence in the form. So the first thing to fill out is the, the text input, then the check boxes. Uh, so this makes it really nice to, to organize the form. And then another new feature here is the help content. So in these form items, there's a new help content property. And when I run this one, you'll see what that does. Uh, this allows us to display some, some help content next to the contents of our form. So there we go, uh, there's some help content here uh, for these different form items. That's a new form control in Spark and Flex 4.5. For more information, you can visit the Adobe Developer Connection. Thanks for watching.